Hello everyone, it's been a while since I streamed last time and I'm still not streaming because my internet Game sucks. Started. I moved to a different apartment and now I still have to install a new internet and that's the reason I've not been active recently. So without further ado, let's play some Rui Lopez. Yeah, that's right. So my rating is incredibly low since my last stream, 2200. Let's try to cross 2300 on this particular occasion and see where it lands us. I wish I remembered the follow-up, but I don't. So let's see. 3 plus 0 is not a long time for the game. Okay, queen d6 makes sense. Developing the queen. Preventing queen a6, prevent... Oh no, it doesn't prevent bishop f4. I thought I'm holding him back from playing bishop f4, but in fact, his queen is protecting it. So, that was a relatively terrible move that I just played. And, um, yeah, probably I have to go back to d8. Here to not lose immediately. <laughs> yeah, that's painful. Oh, and now I'm winning. Wow. What a surprising turn of events. Queen d6, queen d8, rook b4. My probably GM strategy to win a game against a low-rated player. Lure the bishop to f4. And then win. Oh, uh, this is already... Quite convincing, I would say. But even for me, it's too much to, to get the winning position like this. It feels embarrassing. Blundering bishop f4 and then winning a piece. Okay, let's see. Still, it's better to win quickly when you have a winning position. The longer the game continues, the more chances for me to do something to ruin it. So let's try to finish him off as quickly as I can. So here I would take on d5, still threatening the rook. Now he's getting away from my threat, but rook e8 seems almost good enough. Okay, let's see. What's the most convincing approach here? Could go c6 and knight e7. This looks good. Just protecting the knight. And now, 97 with tempo on the queen. And I don't think there is anything you can do. I'm threatening queen takes d1 and I'm threatening knight c6. I'm two pieces up. That's a good time for him to, to give up, I would say. Hmm. Welcoming for challenge. All right, so let's go through the game very quickly. And then, I'll move on to recording it game by game until I reach 2300. So let's see. So now I'm putting some engine in the background. I don't know if you can see the moves that it suggests. 0 0.17, it's Stockfish 8. Did you hear Stockfish 9 is out? That's some remarkable news for the chess professionals out there. However, I try to analyze with it a bit and the evaluations are very fluctuating quite quickly. So I would say, it, I would give it some time maybe to for them to update it to a version that's a bit more stable because right now uh, it's not so easy to, to use. It offers different moves every few seconds. 
Okay, so knight c3 is the move I'm not familiar with. Knight g4 is better for black. Takes takes and bishop h4. Knight g4, knight c6, bishop c6, queen c6, bishop h4, g3, and then bishop f6 simply. Followed by taking on c3 and queen c8. Okay, rook b8 was the logical developing move. And now a3 is probably the most precise. So then he would, I'm sure he would have played b3. And I have to figure out what's the follow up. I, I guess it would be d5 either way. So d5 is not precise because of knight a4. I was a little bit afraid of knight a4. Now bishop c5 is better for black. Yeah, this allowed bishop f4 as I recognized right after playing it. And queen d8 is the best move. And surprisingly enough, I'm only slightly worse after queen c6. And, and I'm not winning a piece. Oh, yes, queen a3. We both missed this relatively simple defense. The idea, of course, is that the bishop on e7 is hanging. And then if rook e4... Server announcement. Still looks... Ah, queen c1. And he's protecting the bishop on f4. Okay. So I just won the piece, and I played relatively... Precisely, <laughs> bishop e1 was a bit more convincing, but still c6 is a nice move, and now the game is over. Two pieces up are too much. Okay, interesting game. Thank you for watching, and see you in my next game on my quest to cross 2300 in this particular session. Bye bye!